Hi guys! Today I wanted to do a haul video. I haven't done one in a while, mainly because I haven't been shopping in a while. I always do my shopping online because I really just can't handle myself <laughs> when I go shopping in stores, for example, like Forever 21. It's just so big. I honestly don't know where to go and where to start and if I ever find anything actually in store, it's because I searched and dug for like at least 30 minutes on like one section of the store. Like digging through every single piece of clothing. They have my style in there, it's just kind of hard to find it. Um, but I like that they have so many different ones so that whenever you do go in, you know, pretty much anyone can shop there. And I also went ahead and shopped on Lulu's. So two of my most favorite so I don't know why that figure was going up. Two of my most favorite stores to shop at online are Lulu's and Forever 21. Lulu's is just the more glammed up version of Forever 21. By the way, do you guys like my hair? I did something different today. Believe it or not, I have no extensions in my hair right now. But I did a really messy side bun and a braid here. Got some hair left down. And I put my bangs over this way. Before anybody asks, I'm just gonna tell you what I have on my lips, just really quickly. This is the Revlon Color Stay Lip Liner in pink slash rose. And then this one is the Lancome Lip Lover. And this is in 355. Yeah, let me know if you guys want me to do this as my next get ready with me look. If not, I have something else in mind. So if you would like a surprise or this look here for the get ready with me for this week, then just let me know and I will base it off of what I see in the comments, what I do. We're gonna start off with what I got from Lulu's. So this is the first thing, it is a dress. It's a white bodycon dress that is very, very tight. It has a zipper in the back. I was like <laughs> trying to get Matt to help me get into. Um, I'm always a size small in Lulu's. This one is so beautiful with the embroidery design here. Like when I try and pick out clothes, I always want to find something that's just a little different. Like something about it that makes it unique compared to, you know, other things that I see. I would totally recommend something like this for, you know, like nights, night outs or special occasions. Maybe even a wedding, which I am actually going to a wedding. My brother is getting married in September on Labor Day weekend and I haven't even told anybody yet on the vlog channel so they don't even know but we're leaving we're driving all the way up to Illinois to go to a wedding and that's mainly the reason why I bought so many things this time for dressing up because I wanted to uh, find like the most perfect outfit there's well there's two different days that I need to be dressed up for so this might be an option it might be something that I wear next from Lulu's I also got this dress I wore it in my latest makeup tutorial that I just uploaded recently called Amber Blush and I love this color. It's so bright. It's like a bright coral pink. I love the lace on it. That type of fabric is always has always been one of my favorites. I like that the straps are like so tiny and I love the way that this looks because it really lets your um, upper body like shoulder area stand out. The back is actually completely open. And then it zips like near the bum area. <laughs> so it stops the underskirt and then just becomes lace fabric. Like how pretty is that? So nice. Next I got this skirt and this is also from Lulu's. <laughs> so this is a really long one. I am so obsessed with maxi anything right now. Maxi skirts, maxi dresses, maxi tops like as in PJs that go to your knees that are supposed to be shirts but they're just like oversized. I'd love anything that's just really long right now. I'm like totally into that and mainly because I like the silhouette that it gives to the body. I always try and look for one that has slits in it because I'm not really a fan of the ones that just go straight down and have really no movement to them. Like I need a slit in there so that when I walk my leg kind of peeks through it. It's kind of like a little bit sexy, just a little bit. Oh my god, like the fabric. It's like a silk fabric so it just it just flows, you know what I'm saying? Like you could just stand there and it's like flowing around you. This is like the most perfect skirt I could have ever found. It's just beyond, like it's just beyond. I absolutely love it. Mm. Oh, oh, it's sticking to me. <laughs> Next I have this dress and I know I have one kind of similar to it from um, TJ Maxx that I recently wore in my favorite elf products video, but this one I had to get because I've seen so many fashion bloggers wearing this. I am totally in love with the, the nude underneath and then the black lace over top. I just can't help myself when I see it. I'm like, 
like I have to get it. That design is just draws me in and I'm like oh my gosh so yeah I finally got my hands on it and it's just so gorgeous I love how it wraps around the neck tightly all right so everything else that I got is from forever 21 I'm gonna try and go through them a little bit more quickly because I have got a lot of stuff from there so I did pick up a few PJs these are really cute they have bunnies on them and I love PJs that are really loose and that you know I can just feel like nice and breathable in. I hate wearing tight things when I go to bed. So these just are so comfy and I love anything like this, like especially with the drawstring so I can make it nice and loose. And I got this dress. Well, it's like a t-shirt oversized dress and it says, you are the best thing since sliced bread. I just thought it was funny. I love recently wearing these to bed. It's also really comfortable and I find that Matt likes them when I wear them. And there's this one that says 100% sleepy. So same exact thing, just a loose oversized t-shirt dress thing to go to sleep in. It's just something that, you know, is really comfortable to wear and just doesn't require any thinking. I just literally slip it on and I'm ready for bed. I got this t-shirt, another thing to sleep in. It says, wish on a follow, what? Wish on a star, follow your heart. So I'm trying to read it through my mirror. But this isn't a dress. It's just an oversized t-shirt. The other one's actually looped down so that it covers your bum and your front. This one's just a t-shirt so it won't cover anything down there. I'm gonna have to wear something with it. I thought it would look cute with my little um, bunny pajama bottoms. This is an interesting top. It's something that I thought would look good for filming. You know, just a simple cami underneath. You can completely see through it, but it's just this beautiful lace with flowers. It's got sleeves and it's really loose, just a loose crop top, something that I feel would, you know, look really good with maybe um, like a bodycon black skirt. I got this crop top. It's really cool. It has a zipper in the back, really tiny straps. This like totally reminded me of Ariana Grande, so I was like, I think I should get this. This will look really cute with a mini skirt. A really flowy mini skirt. Now this is just like a jumpsuit. I really don't wear these often, but I don't know, depending on how it looks on me, I really wanted to try it on first. Um, I'm thinking that this might be another really cute option for the wedding that I'm going to. It kind of reminded me of like Serena Vanderwoodson from Gossip Girl. I feel like she would wear something like this. It's got like a little keyhole opening here, and then the back is completely open. Some awesome eye makeup and a glossy lip and really high black or nude heels. Probably nude heels, because it's not. In winter, black heels, since I'm going to the wedding re like soon, it'll probably be nude heels. But I just thought it would be like a showstopper kind of outfit. You know, like you walk in and everyone's like, whoa. I also got this. The shoulders are completely popping through, and it's just long, well, not completely long sleeve. It is three quarter sleeve. I love these because you can either wear them like up, like up here on one shoulder and down on the other, so it's like super slouchy and chill. Or you can wear it like this and be kind of like glam with it and like flirty, you know what I'm saying? I just love how loose it is and how effortless it looks. I'm big into the color white because it's just so simple to wear something like this. And the bottoms, the bottoms are so cute. Like, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's so cute with the little frills on the ends. Also got this one. It's a really, like, in-your-face print. It's just a crop top shirt. Small straps. And I, and I really just like this style of shirt lately. And the back has a cute little keyhole, too. Oh, I also got this. This is so cool. So I'm really big into cutout shirts and I haven't like bought one in a while. This one's just slightly cut out right there at the shoulder. Um, I've never seen anything like it so I was like, oh that's so unique. Like the ones that I usually see are the one, one I'm about to show you that have like the ribs. This is a really good layering piece. I could totally also picture this, you know, like underneath of a leather jacket or something like that. This one is actually a dress. It's not a shirt, it's actually a dress. So it's kind of different since I already do have once a shirt similar like this. The one that I have already is a, it has these detail, this detail here, but it's short sleeve and it's just a shirt. So this is cool because it's long sleeve and it's a dress. And I just love this. It feels like so badass when I wear it. It's like one of Matt's favorite things that I wear because it's like, it, I don't know, it just makes me look bad, you know? <laughs> 
Alright guys, so that is it for my haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and look forward to more for next week. So I'll see you guys then. Love you. Bye.